Hey guys, today for the swim session, we're gonna swim a total of about 2,100 meters. I'm gonna see how fast I can do uh, 600. That's the longest I've gone without stopping. On uh, last swim session a few days ago, the longest I went was 420, and I averaged a pace about 140 per 100. So I was really, I was stoked about that. That was awesome. But we're gonna now add extra length. I'm swimming from here to the logs there, and, and back. From here to the logs is 75 meters. On Google Maps, it says like 80 meters, but I'm just gonna go by 75 meters because I'd rather lowball it and then be like pleasantly surprised. 75 there, 75 back. And every time I do a rep, I'll basically do lengths of that. So when I go there back, it's 150. And I'll keep doing that to get to 600 today. I'll probably do a couple 300s and then focus on form for 150. doing a 750 meter time trial and uh, I did it in 1404 factoring in the point that I have to stop and turn around factoring in that time and factoring the time that I come here at, and stand for like two seconds before I go to the next rep not to mention I do a lot of zigzagging in a perfect run I could definitely do like sub 14 minute on the 750 which I'm really surprised with I didn't think I could do that but uh, now we're just gonna focus on technique I'm just gonna do a lot of 150s like there back focus on my breathing one of the problems is I always breathe to one side so I'm gonna focus on breathing on both sides. Uh, I always breathe to the left side, and I think that's also part of the reason why I end up going to the left when I swim. See how sick the yeah, cor the Corvette looks? I know, under they, 100 grand. That thing right now looks better than the Ferrari. Yep. It's crazy how they look so similar though. See. Well, but, uh, especially it if you were so yeah, similar. They, they made it look more like a, uh, a, a supercar, right? Now you got a Mustang too. Mustang. Total session was 2100 meters in about 34 minutes and we're having a post-workout meal. I'm gonna ride after this digest in about an hour. I basically did a 750 swim in under 14 minutes if I actually just swam straight. I noticed anytime I'm starting to get tired and fatigue, I really have trouble breathing to the right side. My legs sink. So I focused on that for the last half of the session and I was doing bilateral breathing pretty easily. My goal actually for the race, for the swim is to do anything under a 15 minute swim feeling great, like not being gassed. Cause I want to put the focus on, on the bike and the run. Toast with peanut butter and jam, reason natural with honey and strawberry jam with turkey burgers. I do have a two hour ride. I was debating doing a two hour ride into a brick, but I have some blisters on my toes and it's really bothering me from doing a lot of beach days, walking on the sand, I got all these blisters under my toes. We ended up doing 66 kilometers on the bike in two hours and 20 minutes with a brick, two kilometers fast off the bike, averaged 420 per kilometer. Felt good after, felt real good, sweating like crazy. Ended up consuming about 140 grams of carbs over the entire duration. I'm all showered up, I had protein ice cream, two scoops of chocolate away with a bunch of frozen berries, then I snacked on raspberries and blueberries as I watched some triathlon training videos, learning more about swimming technique. Now I'm having peanut butter toast with jam on top, and it's 6.30 p.m. This is gonna be the last meal I'm gonna have. I'm just gonna eat this while I watch some videos and then read for the last hour before bed. So I'm watching Global Triathlon Network, that channel. Tips and strategies for my first race coming up in eight weeks. Here we are, ready to swim. It's quite windy, a little chilly. Probably about uh, 14, 15 degrees Celsius outside, but we're gonna get after it. Hey, what's happening, bro? Oh, What's I up? I big water jug today. No, no, no. What are you training, bro? We're doing some upper body, so we're doing some back, shoulders, um, arms, and then chest. First I heard right you got here. robbed Saturday. Oh, I did get robbed Saturday. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing today? Uh, legs. legs. We're training legs. legs sorry. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing uh, four sets of deadlifts, then all I'm going right. to do four sets of back squat. Right. After that, uh, Bulgarian split squats, and all then right. core and stretching. Roughly 303. 303. I had a uh, pre workout as a Toast with PB and J. Three oh, slices. Go. That's a pre-workout combo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's got 27 minutes left to kill it. Yeah, then um, I have a two-hour bike session after. We gotta plan another beach day soon. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Another beach day is coming probably this weekend. 
and then we're gonna go to EDC in, in Vegas. Oh yeah, October. he's coming. So coming. I got yeah yeah. We're both going EDC October. Total week, yeah. Should be fun. Well uh, yeah, we'll get a full vlog for that. Yeah. We're having our post-workout meal. We're having haddock with coconut basmati rice, and I'm just gonna hydrate up. We're ready to head out now. We got three scoops of scratch in here, three scoops of scratch in here. So 60 grams of carbs in one bottle, 60 grams of carbs in the other bottle. Total about almost two liters of liquid. We're gonna drink that during the two hours. <laughs> Just got back into the ride and I actually fell. <laughs> I was I had to go slow down to turn around. My back tire flew out. Bam! Just tumbled. Just got a couple scratches. Nothing. Nothing major. And the bike's good. In the two hours, we did 54 kilometers and averaged 179 watts. Post workout meal is two slices of turkey bacon with one and a half cups of egg whites and coconut basmati rice with this fruit to go zero calorie drink. Editing a YouTube video. Usually I sleep at nine, but it's already 8.30. So I might end up staying up to about 9.30. I just gotta finish editing this video and I gotta get some more food in to be honest. Now we're just gonna have half this bag of crispers as I finish editing for the night. It's already 9 p.m. Hope you enjoyed the video. Anthony was good entertainment. Please like and subscribe and uh, we'll see you in the next one.